Well, it is Friday, August 27th. Yeah, makes sense. And uh, a progress report. Some big movement here. Um, my whole goal is to, uh, you know, get Jack by 40, get my degree by 40, be on a, be not unemployed by 40, be employed by 40. So that's the three big things. Of course, this one, the videos that I'm not downstairs talking around my weight equipment. I'm more talking about the other goals. Um, yeah, or the other tenants or facets of that main goal. So, good news and bad news for me. Um, I'll start with bad news. It seems highly imminent that I am going to fail a course. I haven't failed a university course before, at least not really. I mean, I've withdrawn with a zero because I just didn't do it. But no, I, uh, I'm about 25% of my way through this course. Um, it's terrible. Not te it's not a terrible course. It's terrible for me. I hate research. Uh, especially research that I'm not interested in, which is this. Like company 10K reports and strategy of Bell and strategy of Netflix. I don't really care. Um, yeah, so it's the granddaddy Mac of the degree. It's It brings in all understandings of your degree from marketing, finance, accounting, human resources, ethics, everything. And it just throws it all in together and you've got to do a crap ton of work on your own in these forums and the assignments are like 10 pages. The exam is you got to memorize a, a 10K report, which is essentially an annual report from a big corporation. Memorize it, not, mem not memorize it, but yeah, essentially know what it's, what's in it. And it's like a 50 something page report. And then you got to write an exam on it about strategy like you're some top CEO or director. It's foolish for an undergrad. Why? No one knows. Uh, yeah, so completely irrelevant for my level of uh, job entry, that's for sure. But nonetheless, uh, I'll get to why I'm failing it and the reasons that which is the main meat of this is um, uh, why I'm failing, of course. And something I don't want you to do, because I don't want you to be in my situation. Because it was avoidable. The good news. The good news. Why am I failing the course imminently? Because it's not due until October 11th. Matt, why are you giving up so early? Because I got a job. So, I am now officially one for three. The body is not the best it's ever been. I don't have my degree, and I might not even have it by 40, which I'll get to. But, as of Monday... The 30th, I have a full-time job. I'm very excited. I was actually in the dumps because of this job being in uh, the stratosphere of the unknown. Uh, I thought it was going well, but there was no reply back, no communication. And yeah, I thought it was just going to be another one of those destined to fail moments, which was a real bummer. It wasn't. It was just long communication, ill communication, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, I got my offer letter today. So it's enough money to live. Just a bit more than live. Like, maybe like Little Caesars takeout once a week. And live. Which is great. And um, not going to stress bullets over putting some gas in the car. Which is be great again. So yeah, it's enough to live. The schedule is four days a week. Long weekends. Every weekend. Sunday, I mean Saturday, Sunday, Monday, wonderful. So that's the job update. I'm glazing over that, if, but bear in mind, this was this was the breaking point in my life. I mean, I was turning into a complete nut job. I had nothing working out, and if it wasn't for this job, I was on the cusp of losing my mind. So make no small deal of this. This job is, is huge for me. And now I think I have the oomph, or not the oomph, the uh, the fuel in the tank, the catalyst to go back to attacking everything else in my life and trying to succeed, whether it be the gym, getting jacked, uh, getting my degree done. So, why am I failing this friggin' thing? Uh, time restraint. Uh, realistically, I looked at policy, accounting, management systems, and strategic management, which is the three big courses I'm doing right now that have to be done by October 11th no final date or no more further deadlines that's the end um it can't be done i i genuinely can't do it coming home 
having two hours in the evening and three, even three days off with the amount of course load left on the other courses, which is about 60 to 70% in each course. So I have to make the, the decision now. So I'm not actually going to fail all three and mitigate against failing all three and try to pass the other two with a decent B ish. And this one may need to go on the sidelines. Yeah. Why did that happen? Procrastination, baby. In a big way. In a very shameful way. Uh, February and March, I allowed some circumstances that weren't as devastating as they were in my mind to actually trip me up. And I freaked off. I didn't do work for, yeah, like six, seven weeks at all. Wasted time. Watch YouTube. Fiddled around my guitar. Watch more YouTube. Played more games on that stupid phone. Uh, useless games, like juvenile, pointless, time-wasting games. One game is actually called Time Waster. <laughs> That's where I wasted my time. You can't make that up. Um, yeah, so procrastination has a real, real, tangible, concrete effect. And it's going to be a fail in my transcript. Redoing the course and the 25% that I've already done, that I've wasted essentially is now useless, redundant time. And the biggest one, maybe 800 bucks to do it again. If the book is, if the book isn't changed, which of course the universities, it's a completely, I'll stop there. They've changed the book. I know it. I know they have. They changed the book every like two weeks to make money. So yeah, I won't be able to use the book. So it's going to be about $800. So yeah, I, I want to talk to you all about procrastination. Just a little tidbit. Sometimes grace is given to you and... The situation doesn't nip you in the bud. That's probably not the, that's not the saying. Kick you in the crotch. That's the, that's the saying. Um, sometimes the, the situation doesn't kick you in the crotch. Uh, this time it did for me. Uh, I'm not getting away from this one. There's just not enough time to complete it, and I'm going to fail. Because I procrastinated. I, I should have been doing this back in the winter. After that, there were some genuine uh, circumstances that came up where my studying was thrown out of moving, looking for a place. Uh, oh, there are, there are some personal things. There's a lot going on. Not weird, crazy stuff that I'm trying to hide. Just legitimate reasons why studying was not really on the docket. So, uh, yeah. Failing. But I got a job. And I'm failing because I procrastinated. So, I didn't procrastinate with trying to get a job. I was quite on the ball with that. So, I'm glad that paid off. I did a lot of pavement pounding and applications and a ton of rejections. So I want you to know, don't procrastinate. Don't pull a mat. Don't fail a course. But if you do, you just got to do it again. And you suck it up. You pay the money, even though it sucks. You do the course load again, it sucks. Um, maybe you lost an investment, you got to start saving up again. I, I don't know what your situation is. And no one interacts with me on social media. How would I know? Uh, but yeah, whatever it is you're doing, if something kicks you in the crotch, as they say, get back and do it again. Don't give up. I want to give up, but I'm not going to give up. So will I get my degree by 40? That's the real bummer. Probably not. Um, this is probably going to take me until late November, early December. So I'll probably go in course shy. But I'll, obviously I'll keep updating. And This video has gone on too long, obviously. And uh, I got a job, gonna fail, procrastinated, don't do it, be better, take my word of advice. If you have a task in front of you, get to it. Just do it. Take the task, put it in front of you, figuratively or literally, and just do it. As much as that you hate doing it, it will pay off. And it will develop character and you'll be better for it. And I want you to be better. I want you to not be in my situation be better. All right. Talk on uh, next week when I'm working out again. <laughs>